Hi there, this is Rochester and I'm here to introduce you to Photoshop CS6. Well, here I will talk about the four features that I like it most. I've done also a more in deep review that is published on designmodel.com. So here we will we'll see just four features, but if you want to see the complete review, just go there. Let's start. Well, the first one that I want to talk about is the crop feature. So, uh, maybe you remember that this is how it used to be. Um, this is, is not a really good preview, since you need to actually crop the image before you see the final result. So you can rotate, resize it, but you can't see the final result until you really press enter and, and then you have the final result and you check if it's okay or if it isn't. So let's see. Now in Photoshop CS6 you have a really good preview. As you can see the canvas stay fixed and what changes is the background image. So wh while you, you are cropping you can see the final result. This this preview is exactly what you see when you press enter. So it's really really better. The second one is, is a small option that, that we have now under edit preferences and interface. Oops. Mm, now you can select the color of the Photoshop screen. So if you don't like the too white style, you can just select a, a darker or or grayish one. So it's it's really good. I really really like the options and depending on the work that you will do Now let's talk about the blur gallery. This is a really fast option for cool effects. So you can easily apply two sheet blur and iris blur which I, I really like it. You can can apply a bokeh effect so it will increase the highlight areas and this this work great for background images so I really like this one this is, this is a really good option for quick and good effects Well, the last one is the one that most impressed me. It's something called paragraph styles. Oops. Mm, okay. As you can see, we have we have different styles for our text. So this allow us to work pretty much as we work with CSS effects. So we have this paragraph style. If I copy and paste. And okay. Oops again. So I have a paragraph. And let's say I want just hit the button and it's there and, and this is really good mainly for the front-end guy because he can just come here and see what we have
have as font family size letter spacing the padding after the element and this one is really 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 good so this was the last one hope you like it and sorry about my bad english skills as as you may notice i'm not a na native speaker i'm from brazil so mm. i'll see you next time